If a man's mind becomes pure, his surroundings will also become pure. Mind is everything. What we think, we become. I am always at the beginning. There are three ways to correct our faults. We can change through behavior. You can change through understanding. We can change heart. All is passing. When one realizes this, he sits loose to this world of sorrow. This is the way of purity. If a string has one end, it has another. If dresses would have qualified people, then whores would have ruled the world. As a mountain isn't shaken by the wind, so the heart of a wise person is unmoved by all the changes on this earth. He who experiences the unity of life sees his own self in all beings. No one outside ourselves can rule us inwardly. When we know this, we become free. Develop a mind that is vast like space. Where experiences both pleasant and unpleasant can appear and disappear without conflict, struggle or harm, rest in a mind like vast sky. Why do what you will regret? Why bring tears upon yourself? Do only what you do not regret and fill yourself with joy. See the truth, and you will see me. Purity or impurity depends on oneself. No one can purify another. The true master lives in truth, in goodness and restraint, nonviolence, moderation, and purity. Your purpose in life is to find your purpose and give your whole heart and soul to it. Buddha is in our hearts. Buddha is in our mouths. Buddha is in our daily lives. Thousands upon thousands of lights is inferior to a light of heart. Dwell not on the faults and shortcomings of others. Instead, seek clarity about your own. Fashion your life as a garland of beautiful deeds. To do a little good is more than to accomplish great conquests. Be vigilant. Guard your mind against negative thoughts. Meditate. Live purely. Be quiet. Do your work with mastery. Like the moon, come out from behind the clouds. Shine. Happiness or sorrow, whatever befalls you, walk on untouched. Unattached. <laughs>